Welcome to the Dreamer Pet Shop. What can I do for you today? You've got a new dog. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. And you need to buy some products, some supplies for your new pet. Okay. Well, you've come to the right place. What sort of dog is it? Mm hmm. A medium sized dog. Okay. Do you know how much it weighs at all? Okay. About 15 kilograms. Okay. That's really useful information. And is it any particular breed? Mm-hmm. You got it from a, a rescue, a shelter. Okay, that's lovely. So nice to give an animal a new start in life. That's a wonderful thing that you've done. So, it's a mongrel. It's all mixed up breeds, not one in particular. Okay. And, um, what sort of coat does it have? short coat. Okay, that's good. That's easy to care for. Mm -hmm. And do you have any idea how old your new dog is? I know it's hard with rescue animals to know exactly. Has the vet or the shelter given you some idea? Okay, so around four or five years old. Okay. So not a puppy, not a young dog, no. But um, not too old either, so you'll have many happy years together. It's really nice. So what products are you particularly looking for today? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you just need some treats, some dog treats, and some little snacks. Okay, well I can help you with that. So I'll show you some of the um, most popular products. Is that okay? Great. Alright. Well, I've got two rescue dogs. A little bit older than yours. Uh, a little bit smaller than yours as well. But uh, one of their favourite treats is... these so these are the baker's whirlers um, at the baker's um, office the company that makes these they have a Labrador called Max can you see? There, there's Max. Shall I tell you about Max? We're both dog lovers, aren't we? So he is their cheeky, cuddly Labrador cross. He's always on the lookout for treats. Labradors are notoriously greedy. I used to have a Labrador cross, also a rescue. And uh, yes, he was a greedy doggy. 
So Max enjoys playtime in their office garden. He's got his best friend called Tucker. And playing ball is one of his favourite games. Now for a medium sized dog. Which your new dog is at 15 kilograms body weight. You'd be looking to give treats to these baker's whirlers. Just uh, four of these a day. Okay. It's really important with dog treats that although doggies love them, and it makes us happy to see them wagging their tail. Um, and anticipating the treat we must not overfeed our dogs because it's really bad for them yeah I know you understand so these ones have bacon and cheese flavour made by Purina Baker's brand. So I would recommend these for sure. Also, they're low in fat, so that's really good. So the next ones I want to show you are made by a pedigree and they're called Schmackos. So these are the pedigree schmackos. These ones are beef flavour and they have 20 strips in each packet. These are quite good because they also have omega-3 in them as well as vitamins and minerals. Um, Omega-3 is really good for general overall fitness and vitamins help to maintain their immune system and this has calcium in it too which is as we know good for teeth and bones so the instructions on these pedigree schmackos are really um, interesting and uh, educational I think so this is a complimentary pet food for adult dogs. Small dogs such as a Dachshund would just have one stick per day. Medium sized dogs like a Cocker Spaniel, which I think is similar to your dog, can have up to 1.5 sticks per day. So you can see you have to keep these treats um, for quite a, a special part of the day, not to keep having them all day. And large dogs such as a Labrador would have up to three sticks per day. Um, it's always important to have fresh drinking water. I'm sure you know that already. But um, say for example you were out and about and you wanted to take these as a treat for your dog. It's a good idea to take some dog water with you as well. Okay. Once these are open they do need to be used within um, 14 days okay. uh, I don't mind opening these packets because we do get a lot of customers in that bring their dogs with them so I get through quite a lot of dog treats every day for my uh, doggy customers 
the next ones I wanted to show you are smaller they're by Baker's they're called All Sorts These come in a nice little packet. These are chicken, beef and lamb flavour. These are quite nice because you do get the different sizes, they're quite fun. So they're each different flavours, so you get your circular one. And a little bone shaped one. information about another doggy. Can you see that doggy called Brooke? So Brooke lives at the offices of the manufacturer and it says she is their resident lemon cocker spaniel. It's quite an unusual breed. She loves spending time with her friends in the office. At home, her favourite activities are swimming and beach walks, um, which she does at the end of the day. And she loves relaxing on her bed. Sounds like Brooke knows what the good things in life are. Now for your dog, the recommended amount per day of these is seven pieces. Mm. It's important to say as well that with something like the schmackos, which are quite big, they're very easy to snip up with scissors. So you can snip one strip up and give your dog little pieces throughout the day. They do find them very tasty. So that's another way to make them go further. The next product is a hard biscuit with a kind of marrowbone centre, they're called Markies.
So these are actually mini marquees, which probably would be a good uh, product for your dog because it's not a big dog. So these are by Pedigree and they are a delicious filled roll with marrowbone. Again, like the Schmackos, they do have the Omega 3 inside them. The feeding instructions for a dog of your size would be up to uh, 19 biscuits, but that's per week. So you'd have to um, break that up per day if you were going to give them per, per day. So, I mean, between two and three a day, really over a week. The information on the back of this packet says dogs love to play. Marquis rolls are really crunchy biscuits with delicious centres. They're great to roll, throw and catch, making playtime together more fun. Pedigree make delicious treats choose hearty main meals and complete dry foods for all dogs and this also has added vitamins and minerals as well the next product I wanted to show you uh, is by Baker's and they're called Rewards showed you. They come in beef, chicken and lamb flavour so there's three different colours in here and um, similar to the Schmackos by Pedigree. These, I don't know if you can see this but they um, they have little indentations so it's easy for you to break them up into little pieces like this and um, you could use them for training purposes or little treats on a dog walk and put them in your pocket in a little bag or tub um, so per day for a dog of your size it would be three pieces maximum but as you can see you can chop them up um, you can chop them up into two, three, four, five, six, seven little pieces so that would actually be 21 little pieces throughout the day which is quite a lot of treats isn't it now as with all of these products there's the little dog this one's called Smudge. Smudge is an excitable, friendly Wheaton Terrier. She loves the attention she gets in the office and enjoys playing with her friends in the park. She likes long walks, swimming and getting dirty. And she's not a fan of having a shower to clean off the mud afterwards. That sounds like most dogs, to be honest. The final snack that I wanted to show you is made by Win-A-Lot. It's our only um, Win-A-Lot 
but a branded product also made by Purina. So these are the, um, the, the wholesome shapes. These are your classic dry dog biscuit. So you can see those different shapes there. Very handy to put into your pocket for a dog walk. They're not very, um, they don't have all of the bacon aromas and meaty aromas that some of the others have. Um, so these are wholesome biscuits that help give your dog the bounce he needs to go out and enjoy family life. You can use them as a snack treat or a tasty reward during training. So these biscuits have uh, fibre to help support healthy digestion, B vitamins to help support vitality and sustain energy levels. And they contain antioxidants to help support natural defences. They do have uh, added vitamin A and vitamin D3, vitamin E as well. And some vitamins from the B group. So for a dog of your size of 15 kilograms, they can have up to five of these biscuits a day. Okay. Now I know you hadn't mentioned wanting this next product but I did just want to share it with you because it's really important to look after your dog's teeth. Dog's teeth can get in quite a bad state if they're not looked after. Can I show this next product to you? So here we've got this um, fresh mint uh, dog toothpaste and the little doggy toothbrush you just put it on your finger um, apply some of the toothpaste onto you and then you put it into your dog's mouth and you brush their teeth 
don't tend to like it to start off with but if you make it a regular thing say every evening for example after they've had their dinner their evening meal um, they do get used to it and some of them quite enjoy it you could give them a little treat afterwards so it's worth their while and they look forward to it um, I do do this with my dogs most days and it's fine makes me feel better knowing that I'm looking after their teeth mm. so which of these products would you like to take away today? you'd like to take the toothbrushes it comes in a multi-pack the toothbrushes mm. so a multi-pack of toothbrushes the fresh mint dog toothpaste which treats do you think would be good for your dog? The all sorts, okay. And the baker's rewards. Yeah, that's a really good choice. They're both soft and you can cut them up into smaller pieces. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's great. Alright, well if you'd like to take them over to the checkout now, then um, you can get them bagged up and pay for them over there. Is that okay? Good, it was lovely to meet you. Please do come back again to the Dreamer Pet Shop. And next time you could bring your uh, furry friend with you if you like. And they can get a treat too. Okay, nice to see you. Bye bye.